Join Stella Academy, Goa's best coaching for IIT, JEE and medical exam preparation. Best online learning experience only at Stella Online Courses. Call us now. Uh, seven Cs, uh, Voyager, Ajay Oil, Jay Goinkar, Seafarers, Dhyanle, Te Basin, Buslale Kal, Ani already Patra Devi, Them Cross Kela around uh, today. Ani Ani Char Basu, Karnika Oil, Burgiyan, Gion, Baisolle, Kal Sadida, Orange, Ratipada, Te Baisolle. This is the update of those two vessels. Ani Ji Noi Hobar Mulder, Ji Kal Amka Ek Amcho Tarvati Bao, Jo Cargo Shipsa Oil, Dhyanle, 30th of April. So a clarification that uh, he was not a seafarer part of any of the cruise ship. So cargo vessel will be on law and he has no protocol for locally done and as per the protocol uh, to negative found on taking quarantine and he will be on the way to quarantine and he will be on the way to go in the way to check a positive moon to check a lot. We want to make one thing very clear to everyone including the government. This does not mean to Tarvati Burgo Botir son positive Devon Illo or Botir son positive Devon Yuna. There has been contamination in Mumbai in the hotel, there has been contamination during the passage, and that is the reason in this 14 days quarantine period. That means the quarantine facility, although saying that it was approved, was not of approved standards, and that is the reason he has got contaminated there. And he has reached here and he is found positive. There are temperatures and all. Is it over the phone? You are going to check the temperatures? So please, this is big failure on our part. Tanka Sagrang Vasco Hotel at the Valyat. Anikoi Boti Goyat Yopacho Asat. Mayacha Nimanya Saptakat Yoyata Munkalta. And uh, JM Bakshi, the company which has got them here, uh, the agents for the owners, we did their uh, COVID tests on board the uh, ship. And once all of them had their uh, COVID negative uh, results, they were all uh, put in a sanitized bus as soon as they disembarked from the ship. And they have been brought uh, directly to the hotel where they will be quarantined for 14 days as per requirement of uh, state government. And uh, state government has been very, very supportive by the health uh, services, the collector's office, secretary shipping. They have been very, very helpful. So they will be all put up here for 14 days. Uh, they are all COVID negative and they all have their certificates of uh, COVID negative. All are local Goan boys. We have so many seafarers uh, working all around the world. So we have a ship which will bring about 400. There's another ship that will bring about 800. Then again, there is another ship that is bringing 500. So there is, uh, there are at least five or six ships that are already lined up. But uh, we are trying to support the state government by staggering it so that, you know, uh, in one go, you don't have too many people and it does not put pressure uh, onto the local authorities, the uh, police department, the health department. They have been absolutely amazing. Uh, the next ones which I have been talking about, this 400 and 800, uh, they all are going to be brought directly over here. They will be first tested. Uh, after they are tested only, then they will be allowed to walk out of the port limits. Otherwise, they are not allowed to come out of the port limits. So when is the vessel expected, sir? The next one, uh, the earliest one is 30th May. Uh, okay, that is called the ovations of the sea, but the date is not confirmed. But it will be around the 30th of uh, May that ovations of the sea will be calling Goa. Bureau report, prudent.